This is an ultrasound clip demonstrating several small gallstones seen in the neck of the gallbladder. Notice that the probe marker is on the left side of the screen here, and a curvilinear probe is being used as delineated by the shape of the probe footprint at the top of the screen. To obtain this view, I like to start by placing the probe in a sagittal orientation along the right costal margin with the probe marker pointed towards the patient's head. A good place to start is around 7 centimeters to the right of the patient's midline, also known as X plus 7. The probe can then be slowly slid laterally until the gallbladder comes into view as shown above. In this image, we can appreciate the lever seen here on the left side of the screen. A long axis view of a distended gallbladder is seen here. Notice that the fundus of the gallbladder appears anechoic and normal. However, as the probe is fanned, Notice that in the neck, we see several hyperechoic structures with associated posterior shadowing consistent with gallstones. There is also this area here, which appears hypoechoic. This is likely consistent with biliary sludge. Moving our eyes to the gallbladder wall, it appears thin and very homogeneous, and there's no evidence of pericholecystic fluid. This ultrasound image, in conjunction with a patient with acute abdominal pain and a negative sonographic Murphy sign, would suggest a diagnosis of acute biliary colic.